I am Vikrant Dagar from Center for Peace and Spirituality International. I'll be talking on real worship. According to Quran, worship of God controls one's character. The Quran says, surely prayer restrains one from indecency and evil. The Quranic verse gives us a very important aspect of worship. It presents the true picture of the worship of God. Worship is not a spiritless ritual. Worship is a living act. A worshipper recites verses of the Quran during his prayer. These verses tell him about the do's and don'ts of his daily life. They tell him what the secret of success is and how one can obtain salvation in the world hereafter. It means that Ibadat or worship makes a worshipper very conscious about his daily behavior and his social conduct from his family life to the other walks of the life. After performing the prayer, when the worshipper returns to the society, he is a man with difference. This verse is like saying that one who had attended a health class and has learned the principle of good health will observe those principles of health and attain a healthy life. For example, in his worship, the worshipper repeatedly says, Allahu Akbar, which means only God is great. Greatness is the only of God Almighty. This saying inculcates the spirit of modesty in the worshipper. At the end of this worship, he addresses all the mankind by saying, Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullah. Peace and blessings be upon you. A believer who worships every day and imbibes within himself the spirit from his worship is bound to become a person who is very cautious in his behavior. He would live a life of modesty. He would live with the spirit of peace towards all mankind. This Quranic verse gives us a criterion to judge the veracity of worship of every individual. If one's worship qualifies this criterion, then it is worship in the true sense of the word. Those whose worship does not fulfill this criterion, it is merely a spiritless ritual and not worship. According to Quran, worship is like a ticket to paradise. But this ticket will be granted by God Almighty only to those persons who qualifies the criterion given in the above years of the Quran. Thank you.